what's up Taurus this is evolving wisdom and yes I'm here and I'm still evolving all right Taurus I'm here to give you guys a love spread okay I want to do what is going on with whether it's the, the the energies the people who are no longer in relationships <clears throat> my first spread is going to be about people who are no longer in relationships or um that is just dealing with some issues okay and then i'll do a second spread for like my singles or people waiting on love to come in or if there's a new lover coming in what is the energy wrapped around this okay so <clears throat> you guys i do have that december special still going on on in-depth spiritual reading for 30 dollars my spiritual products you guys and if you need some spiritual work that is available at my website i'm continuously adding new things when it comes to my spiritual work okay things a lot of um, different things my clients have been requesting i have been doing it so i'm putting it up there so you guys go check that out at evolvingwisdom5.com check me out on my ig okay all that information will be pinned at the bottom of this video in the description box Taurus, you are my first spread on this my first reading on this so you guys i'm kind of freestyling i did try it out a, a couple of times okay so let's see how this goes taurus okay so <clears throat> what is going on for my current taurus is when it comes to love love what do you need to know when it comes to love what do my taurus need to know what is going on with my current Tauruses when it comes to love or their separation or they're in love right now? Love energy. <clears throat> okay, Taurus, some of you guys dealing with some down. Fucking male energy, female, however you want to resonate that, who is a manipulator. Okay, they're good with talk, talking that game, very authority type, maybe a little, they're, mm, this person is controlling, okay, they like shit, they like for you to, either, this, see, okay, this person may have come back around to you guys, I've seen this energy before in y'all early December, um, read here, okay, so this person may have come back around to you guys, you guys gave them a second chance here, it's, it's a lot of, it's some issues, it's, it's not gonna go well, it's not gonna go well at all, um, Taurus, Okay, let's see what's the whole in-depth energy around this. Like, what is going on with it? Why, okay? It's a new phase. A lot of you, like I said, a lot of you guys rekindled this energy. I am so sorry about the light, you guys. <clears throat> okay, a lot of you guys rekindled this. This is somebody, um, new energy, I feel like, coming back around. You guys may have met this person maybe two, three months ago, okay? And they're coming back into your energy. They still on that fuck shit, Okay? Still on that fuck shit, okay? Okay, let's see. <clears throat> this is like a union. A union. This person is really, really into you guys, okay? Reminiscing, keepsake, perception, learn from the past. You guys are entertaining this person again. Gave them a second chance. You guys, look, no. No, no, no. This person is still on that bullshit, okay? And it's not going to last. Okay, a mask. You guys got the mask card. These are my new cards, y'all. I think I'm doing my damn thing with these cards. I've been waiting these, on these cards for forever to come in the mail. Okay, not showing true feelings, hiding, okay, pretending. This person is fake. This person is not going to give you what you need. And you guys knew that. You guys went back around. Maybe this person came back around. They said they left that person alone, whoever they were dealing with in the past, or they came in and said, you know, I really realized that I really love you and I want this to work out, whatever the fucking game, because this person is good with understanding words of emotions. Now, can they show you those emotions? Can they give you those emotions, those deep emotions? No. They just know how to manipulate the situation, okay? They're not a person of their word. They're very manipulative, very authority, very... Um, my way or the highway type of person. It's maybe a business woman or a business male energy coming in here. I'm picking up masculine, okay? A lot of disappointments. I really feel like this person, this is a block. And like I said in my uh, early December read, you guys, this, is, this person is blocking you. And they're blocking you still. You guys, yeah, this is a chaser. Codependent. Codependent. 
that is not healthy, you guys. Like that twin flame, y'all see, y'all hear me talk about that shit. That is a very codependent relationship. It is not healthy for you guys to need needing to talk to this person all the damn time, all day. You need to spend time with this person all day. Oh, this person needed to spend time, and this person is doing it because they just want to know what the fuck is going on around you all the time, Taurus. They want to know what you're doing, who you're doing it with, who's around you. Codependent relationship. You guys need to walk away from this. You need to leave this person in the fucking desk. Watching, looking, stalking you. This person was doing, before this person even came back around, this person was stalking, watching, and looking for you. Some of this, I feel like this person, this, this, whoever this energy is, is someone you guys dealt with before or you let go and they're trying, they're wanting to, they're wanting to either come back in, and some of you guys are entertaining this, this person is back in your life. Okay, so resonate that how it resonates here, but who someone is stalking some of you guys. Someone is watching you, looking, okay, seeing what you're doing, wanting to be back in your energy, or is there in your energy, and this person is not gonna show you anything, not gonna give you anything, not is they're fake, they're a phony. Okay, learn from your cycles here. Let's get one more card for this energy here. Don't let this person back in. And if you guys, some of you guys have let this person back in, cut it off. Cut it off. It's not going to go anywhere. It's a karmic relationship. It's a lesson. It's something you guys need to understand what you have been doing in relationships. Okay? <clears throat> okay, the, <laughs> the Grin Reaper. The relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. What did I say? Some of you guys don't even have this person in your life. Some of you do, okay? I'm trying to give y'all both scenarios here. Some of you guys do, some of you guys don't. Man, I feel like if this is somebody coming back around a second time, this person man, is watching you guys, stalking you, codependent, wanting your energy, wanting to be back in your grace, wanting to figure out how can I get back in with Taurus? What can I do? Okay, this is a fucking grim reaper. Look, look at this card. It's kind of hard to see this car but it's the grin reaper here the relationship is over y'all no second chances grow and transform y'all got some other shit y'all got more great things coming from you guys don't entertain this okay this is a fuck boy fuck girl i'm really feeling like a fuck boy okay all right Taurus. let's move on to um my singles or people who are waiting for love okay let's see Okay, let's see. What are my Tauruses who are single? Single, single Tauruses waiting for love. What is the new energy coming in for my Tauruses that have new relationships coming in? Who is that's looking to like the, it's almost looking into the future. Like we're kind of peeping in on what is to come when it comes to this relationship. These, or if you guys are looking to get into a new relationship or thinking a new lover is coming. Or wanting a new lover to come. Okay, let's see. Reaper. I'm just going to go with my Taurus here. So getting a new lover coming in. Okay, you guys. A lot of things are going to be going great in your life. A lot of my Taurus, y'all got a lot of great things going on in your life here. And this person is a new energy coming in. A king of diamonds. <coughs> male energy. This is, a, this is a male energy who's very narcissistic. Okay. Very good with their words here. Just like the um, first spread I read with that king of um, cubs here. But this person knows how to express their energy a lot more. And they may actually mean it. But they're full of shit here. This is a player. This is a real player type of energy coming in. It's a love affair attraction the spirits are telling you to stay the hell away from. Okay? Change is coming. A lot of extreme anxiety and depressed energy coming in with this new lover. Okay, That's, they're warning you here. Okay, they're warning you not to get into a relationship with this new person. Even if you, some of you guys are dealing with this new energy, it's like a new energy coming back around. I feel like this is not somebody from the past. It's just, <clears throat> it's the same energy, but it's a new, um, it's a new face. Okay, jealousy is around you guys, even with this relationship. This relationship is a lot of jealousy, a lot of control, a lot of narcissistic energy coming in. You guys, they want you to be watchful. 
They want you to be careful of jumping into this energy here because this person is a liar. They're a manipulator. They're very, they got a lot of other, I see a lot of women, a lot of male energies, whether male, women, whatever you guys resonate, that how it resonates. Remember, it's energy, you guys. Okay? <clears throat> they want you guys to be cautious here. There's a lot of dark energy around this person. This person is going to turn you guys' life upside down. Okay? This person is really going to turn you guys' life upside down here. Let's see. Taurus is waiting for love. Who is this person? Show me more about what do they need to know. What do they need to know about this new energy coming in? <clears throat> Enjoy yourself. Focus on yourself. Okay? Fall in love. Falling in love with this person, but it's, you guys got the green, gr green, what is this called? The Grand Reaper here, okay? Very deceitful. No, no, no. Quit going around in circles here. Transform your life here. A lot of you guys got no second, it says no second chances. Quit giving these energies chances here. Clarity, truth, revelation, force, honor, protection. You guys need to protect yourself from these damn energies, these, these relationships here. <clears throat> Making healthy choices in love and in your life. Self-love, self-care. wanting This energy, the spirits is wanting you to focus on you right now. Focus on your love. Focus on your boundaries. Focus on your self-care. Okay? Okay, break up. You guys are not even going to end up with this person. Okay, separation, stop the patterns. What do I keep saying? There's a cycle constantly going on. A lot of you guys, you know, I've been getting, getting a lot of downloads over the past week, okay? A lot of my Zodiacs out here are real spiritual healers or, or, or supposed to be doing this type of work. There's a lot of blockages, like a lot of, um, what do you call it? I said this in my last video here, but what is it? <clears throat> what is that Bible scripture where it says... Um, we wrestle with not we wrestle with not flesh and blood, but we wrestle with spirits and high places and principalities. I don't I know it goes similar, goes something like that here. You guys gotta understand it is like a spiritual warfare out here. It's, it's just a big energy coming in. We're trying to keep you guys bounded in this 3D realm. Not not being able to transform into this other, a higher level of spirituality here. The port, it's a lot of portals open right now, um, Taurus. It's, it's a lot of shifting has already transpired. Why do you think we got this Capricorn energy right now? Because Capricorn energy does not play. It wants you to change. It wants you to transform, okay? Take a chance. Risk, <coughs> risk, being, um, risk uh, being strategic. Options, not showing your hand. Play your cards right, okay? Play your cards right. This is what this card means to me. It's, like, it's actually a card here. A lot of endings are coming, okay? A lot of endings I really, really feel strongly here with my, my Tauruses that a lot of blockages are coming in because you guys are about to really walk into your whole, your, your real soulmate here. You're going to really walk into real happiness here in 2020 here. And it's the, the dark energies are coming in to stop you. Stop you from this real happiness. Okay, ascending, transcending, getting over obstacles, learning, new phases, prepare for a union. What was I just saying? You guys got a real union coming in here, and it's not going to be to toxic. It's not going to be codependent. It's not going to be playing around with your energy, okay? You guys aren't going to know it. I was just saying that. I was just saying that. Stability, security, growth, endurance. Look at this. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> new phase. Okay, it's a new trans. You just got. You guys got a little. A lot of you guys who are waiting for love to come in, <clears throat> waiting for that person to come in and be your real soulmate your your non-toxic soulmate that is coming for you guys in 2020 towards you just guys have some obstacles to be aware of a lot of the cycles you guys need to be aware of when it comes to these relationships and don't let anyone block you don't let because these relationships that's coming in they're trying to keep you stagnant 
And that is just the real honest truth. A lot of these relationships coming in, they're trying to keep your ass right in that damn cycle. Right in that pain, heartache, lying, manipulation, codependent, wanting to be around you. Somebody suck. A lot of you guys, the reading I said I did in the beginning <clears throat> for a lot of my uh, people who are in relationships or um, just coming out of a relationship. These people, <coughs> this person is stalking you. Wanting to come in and trying to figure you out. Trying to see how they're going to come back in and woo you again. And some of you guys are entertaining it now. Okay? It's not going to go anywhere. But for my ones who are waiting for love to come in, there is a new energy coming in very soon here. And it's a fucking fuck boy or fuck girl. And you guys need to be aware. It's not saying don't entertain it. But you need to understand. You need to, you guys kind of need to entertain it so you can see. You can see what is really in front of you, what you guys have been allowing in your life with these relationships. You need to prepare yourself for a real union that is coming towards you. There is a real, I've been saying this for my Taurus for a while. Taurus, y'all got a real union coming in, okay? Y'all got your baby coming in. Don't let these people stop you. Don't let these, uh, lo these lovers, these false ass soulmate, like they, they so miss, but they toxic as fuck. Okay, some of you guys got real strong ties to these energies because you knew them before. You knew them in other past lives. Okay, it's time to end those contracts. It's time to end it. All right, Taurus? All right, you guys. You, I love you guys so much. I really do. That's why I wanted to really give you guys this reading first because you deserve it. Maybe I'm being biased because I'm a Taurus, but who gives a damn? Okay, y'all my babies. <laughs> All right, Taurus, that is your read. I don't know what I'm going to call it, okay? I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know, okay? As, as time go on, as I connect more with this type of spread, I will get better, okay? But, all right, you guys, this is Evolving Wisdom. Yes, I'm here, and I'm still evolving. <laughs>